it's really early. Well, it feels early. It's 6 30 in the morning. The sun's not quite up yet. We have a special day today. We're going to the Renaissance Fair. Yay. I know we've been there before. I'm hoping to see some things we have not seen since we have been there or the past times we've been there. And it's been a while. It's been a few years. So, yeah. And we're actually going to be uh, taking that Class C that was purchased through Cruise America. I am so tired I can't even think of that. Yes, we're going to be going uh, in the Cruise America vehicle. So our daughter and son-in-law are driving and we're going to be taking their motorhome to the Renaissance Fair. So that will be happening right after this. So we're here, we're gonna be hopping in the rig, heading out. Uh, I got some pictures that Don took as we were turning the corner from our street coming here. So you gotta check that out. Those people are crazier than we are. You should realize what time they had to be up in the morning to get started with that. But there's gonna be balloons all through the sky today. In fact, there's a couple right up there. Objects are closer than they appear. They started where we were. There'll be more coming up in a moment, I'm sure. Anyways, that's it, we're gonna get going. We made it a long time ago. We were sitting in the rig for about an hour. <laughs> that was a huge line. So now we get to wait in line to get inside. But it was a lot more comfortable than standing in line for an hour, that's for sure. Is that like a queue line? Yeah. Is that like weaving? Oh, wow. Yep. Yeah. Is the village. Maybe we should have waited in yeah, line for the hour. Yeah. Mass of humanity. I already realized one problem. What? No, the fact that I'm wearing sandals, I keep picking up rocks in my sandals. <laughs> and everybody's moving very fast. Okay, wow, so, yep. I think we're heading to jousting, right? Yeah. Okay. Oh. So for some reason we're moving quickly. Jousting starts in an hour. So I guess we're gonna get there early. See what happens. Oh. Well, with that city sign, there's a huge crowd just to watch people blow glass. Huge glass blowing demo. Amazing how many people were there. If you've never been to the Arizona Renaissance Fair, east side of Phoenix, um, gotta check this out. It's one of the few Renaissance Fairs where they have all permanent structures. And it's really quite a cool place. A lot of people in costume, actual regulars here. They don't have the groups that come out. They have actual all paid people that come and work it. So quite a fun place, it really has a great vibe to it. A lot of fun entertainment. Oh. <laughs> I'm not quite sure what he said to me, but could be rude. Don't know. These are pretty loud. I would almost want to come see the fire cat finale. I that could, that could be interesting. I hate to even think what that is. I want to see the fire cat finale at 415. Do they actually set cats on fire for that one? I can't imagine that's legal. Ooh. Huh? 
Seems like every time we get here, we always skip out of the shows and the tournaments. So we're actually going to be here for the tournament this time. So it should be kind of fun. I'm looking forward to it. Team won. We won. Uh, yeah. Pecan nut roll, really good. Yeah. Handwriting analysis. I that I would mess up their minds so bad with my handwriting. I think that's what they do if it's online. <laughs> <laughs> Unattractive people sit right up on the stage. <laughs> we'll make you hotter. <laughs> right this way for the fire show finale. Like an ASU student, we're getting lit. <laughs> <laughs> I 
honestly believe the guy in the cargo shorts was not part of the procession. No. no. If I die, need anything for a Woodstock night? No. Nothing? Okay. Well, we almost lasted the whole day. We're at 5 o'clock and we're starting to head out right now as we beat some of the crowd. If you ever wind up here, a few things to watch out for. All the, as far as food vendors go, Take a look and see what people are walking out with before you order. <laughs> uh, Don and I ordered a couple of things that it, it wasn't what I was hoping or expecting. We, I got a, a pasty, a uh, shepherd's pie pasty. Don got a sausage pastry. And they were like these little things. Um, my son-in-law got a, a bowl that was uh, amazing. <laughs> uh, twice as much food at a, a lot less price. So not everything here, not all the food vendors are created equal. Make sure you check that out. There's a lot of things to do around here, a lot of shows. Uh, there's a lot of shopping, every kind of renaissance festival kind of shop there is, they have them all. Don and Amber walking into the fairy shop creations. If you're into musical instruments, I passed an ocarina stand. I bought a didgeridoo here once. I also bought a wooden flute here once. There's a lot of cool stuff. I mean, a lot of cool things. See at the mask shop next door. Uh, Don and I just walked into one shop. She made a friend in there. It's actually a garb shop. You could actually deck yourself out as light or as heavy as you want. How much money do you want to spend? And you can either look like absolutely, totally authentic or lighten it up some just to have fun. So uh, cool, weird stuff here. So, and yes, I already saw one Jack Sparrow. He actually worked at one of the shops. Also saw someone dressed up as Link from the video game. So yep, you get them all here too. Anyways, we're gonna be heading out here. If I find a quiet place, we'll do a closer. So hold on just a moment. So this basically ends our day at the Renaissance Fair, third time's a charm. Don't know if we're gonna be doing another one here or not, but uh, yeah, we'll probably be back next year maybe. Yes, sorry, I was trying to swallow something. Oh, my that's fine. soda. So anyways, that's gonna be it for this episode. Make sure you hit that subscription it's button. An, it's an animal thing. Yeah, it could be, but I don't know if we'll do another <laughs> video. No. Yeah, so hit the subscription button while you have a chance. <laughs> And hit the bell, let you know when we post every Sunday at 2. Thumbs up for good measure, and we will see you on the road. Salancha. You know it's appropriate to say that here. It is. Yes, okay. Now, and huzzah. Off, and huzzah. Huzzah, huzzah and is more appropriate yes. than Anyways, salancha. let's get out of here. Okay. On our way out.